best friends. They love to play together in the forest, chasing each other through the trees and climbing to the tops of the tallest branches. One day, Cubby and Squeak were playing hide and seek when Cubby wandered too far from home. He got lost in the forest and didn't know how to get back. Cubby was scared. He called out for Squeak but Squeak didn't answer. Cubby was all alone. Cubby started to cry. Suddenly he heard a familiar squeak. It was Squeak. Squeak had been looking for Cubby all over the jungle. Don't worry Cubby said Squeak, I will help you get home. Squeak took Cubby's hand and led him through the jungle. They walked for a long time but Squeak knew exactly where they were going. Finally, they reached the edge of the forest. Here we are, Cubby, said Squeak. You're home. Cubby was so happy to be home. He thanked Squeak for helping him. Thanks, Squeak, said Cubby. I don't know what I would have done without you. That's what friends are for, said Squeak. Cubby ran to his mother and gave her a big hug. Cubby's mother was so happy to see him safe and sound. She thanked Squeak for taking care of her son. Cubby and Squeak continued to be best friends. They learned that they did 